here today just to kind of show that uh, no mobs spawn above 128 um, I'm all the way up here at 259 this block right here is 256 go down to this block it's 251 that's giving it the three air block space that uh, the mob needs to uh, spawn we'll go at a farther distance away because uh, usually uh, that's how that works as you can see that uh, there should be mobs spawning even on the bottom ones but uh, there are no mobs spawning so um, this is also like you know obviously a creative world and it's not a flatland world this is a uh, an actual creative map that I generated just to do this test uh, with my spawners and my tutorial and all that stuff um, so yeah as you can see there's still nothing spawning and we'll go down a little bit there and now it should be okay to kind of stay above them and even down there some should be spawning but they're not hmm. but see that spawner that I have set up down there uh, shouldn't be active either just because of the fact that uh, I'm pretty high up and as we go down eventually it'll start to work because I'll start getting closer to it but uh, that last bar is at 128 you can still see no mobs are spawning above 128 oh we got them right on 128 nothing above but exactly on 128 we have mob spawnage you see that and we'll go down and have a look so I guess they spawn on and up to 128 but not above so there's that little test done um, I guess uh, we could go into the nether on my uh, on my creative map and we could check out the same thing and as you see that those guys will despawn because I've gotten far away see that there's still nothing spawning way up here yep yep alright so we'll go over to the uh, the nether uh, on this map here and uh, actually you know what I will do it together with you and that way we'll kind of you know show you we're on the same same page here and I'm not like changing maps and all that good stuff and to prove to you at the same time too that this is a an actual creative world you know like uh, I guess I should grab a map from here instead now I'll replace that like I said it's an actual map I guess it's just gonna take time to load but it doesn't matter. We'll get the uh, obsidian, and we'll get ourselves a little striker, and we're good to go. See, anyways, one, two, three, four, four. Come on, come on! Don't be dumb. One, two, three. Uh, yeah, that one's right. Boom. Now off to the the end. Or the nether, sorry. <laughs> Been a long day. Alright, so we'll go here and we'll uh oh I love this. This is great. I can't wait to actually start mining this stuff in my LP. It's gonna be awesome. As you see we're still on hard. That's right. So we'll just go up here and we'll get above the nether. 
and this most people already know that you can't uh, that they don't work above here a um, few people have also commented on my videos saying that it's too bad that they don't work uh, but that's all good alright so ready let's get up there look at that flawless not even damage taken Oh yeah, because I'm in creative. But still, you should have heard duck, 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 you know. Anyways, I don't even know if you do. Can you suffocate yourself in freaking creative? I don't know. Anyways, see, we're on 129. 128 would be the, uh, I guess, bedrock uh, layer right underneath me. So, we shall just grab some normal blocks. Place it for the obsidian. And we'll do our little test here. And we'll go all the way up like we did earlier. I don't even think I have to go that far, really, just to kind of prove it. Now, see, pigment should spawn on this. If there were going to be pigment to spawn. But I already know it's not going to happen, so... That's okay. I right, should prove it enough here. do 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 do, -do. So even on that bottom one right now, they should be spawning, and there's nothing. Get up here above them, and voila! Absolutely nothing. So that's that. Give it a few more seconds, and then we'll go into the overworld. The overworld is the only place that you can spawn enemies over 128. And that's it. Sorry to disappoint everybody, uh, but that's what it is. It's too bad, though, because we could have had some really kick-ass farms, you know, going on here. Ah. Uh, who takes me out of fly mode? Did it again. That's okay. And let's go back into the overworld. We'll make a, a quick little chamber. Excuse me. And uh, we'll get that uh, done with. Even though I already know that they're going to spawn up there, but it's just to go on with the test, I guess, right? Just to say, yeah, they do spawn way up there. So we'll make a, a nice little pillar just to get up there. Shouldn't have to go too, too far. And I'll just make like a little box and they should spawn in there. Alright, so where am I? 191. Alright. We'll just make a little box here. Shouldn't take too long for something to spawn in there. That's for sure. Alright. Do, do, do. And I wonder if I should, oh yeah, I'll just like go away from it like I did the other ones. Um, I don't know. We'll give it a, a four air block. How's that? Just to be safe with this. There you go, complete darkness. Let's go up here for a minute or so and admire the view of this nicely generated seed that I randomly generated and that's actually kinda really nice that mountain is over there hmm I like that big ass mountain that's there too I actually kinda like that map a lot of water oh, not much desert that's not good considering we can't use a uh, a jungle um, a jungle what the heck am I thinking a sand generator but it is a really nice map I like those mountains really nice hmm well, I don't know if I'd use it as an LP though, but but some kind of map would be nice out of that. All right, let's go check this out. Let's see if anything has spawned in here while uh, I was up there babbling. And look, we got mobs. So, as I said before, the overworld was the only place that you could uh, spawn mobs, and uh, that's it. So, have a good night, everybody. Peace. Take care. Till the next time.
Thank you.